right, here we go. In addition to appearing in the popular Wedding March series of movies, of course, we've enjoyed our first guest as Bill Avery since the very first season of When Calls the Heart. He's here to tell us all about this year's special Christmas installment, The Greatest Christmas Blessing, premiering December 25th at 8, 7 central, of course, right here on Hallmark Channel. Welcome back, the very talented Jack <laughs> Wagner. Thank you. Hey. We love you, Jack. I love you, man. I think we got to treat this like a podcast. I'm I telling mean, you right like, now. No structure. Um, Wherever we want to go with this, we with as go much with time as we want. How yeah, much everything. fun was that? <laughs> well, you know what? It was awesome because there was just like you know no kind of parameters around anything. No, it really felt like we were in someone's living room. Yeah, yeah. totally, literally. Like, like I say, there's something yeah. about that long form interview that's right. really special. I think people yeah. are really kind of craving it out there. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna dive in. We want to talk about this Christmas okay. special. Yeah, when it calls the sure. heart. But before we do, you know, I follow you on social media. I follow you on Instagram, and recently vice I got versa. A, yeah, well, I have to. Well, you have you to because me. I follow you. So you feel guilty. Yeah. Yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'll take I whatever too, followers I, I can get. Yeah, me too. Of course, I want to ask you about this video okay. that you posted uh, with our buddy Paul Green, who was here uh, just yesterday, yesterday. Yep. and Kevin Smith uh, oh, okay. talking about That's season six. Oh, my gosh. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. To season six of When Calls the <laughs> Heart. <laughs> I mean, nice. Can we just nice. sing wow. right now? You caught me off guard with yeah. that. Jack um, Singers, we even made you sing here. Look, yeah, ja uh, Jack's been here. That's what about a wrap. I went, okay, Paul, take the take the high high. He goes, I said, Kevin, do you sing? He goes, no. And I go, can you go? That's a wrap. And he goes, okay, give it to me. And I go, mm, and he goes, that's a wrap. He was totally <laughs> off. <laughs> I said, so we did that about two in the morning, the oh final day gosh. of shooting. Okay. And it was just something I kind of came up with that they went for, and it, it was just kind of funny little moment that, yeah. that I threw. But out. you're really good at that. I mean, he's very. <laughs> Spontaneous with his social yeah. media and his post on his Instagram. That oh, awesome. thanks. Yeah, yeah, it was a great little deal. It was uh, the wrap of the season. So yeah, and you've wrapped the season, yes, but it, yes. it premieres uh, February 24th, season mm. six I'm talking season. about right now. Right. You obviously know uh, a lot of little in insights and secrets. We know you can't tell us a lot. You can't. But, but we got to ask you about this. We got a, a <laughs> photo that you took with your Melrose Place uh, co-star oh, yeah. from back in the oh, day. Gosh. You know who that yeah. is. Yeah. Oh. Besties right there. Tell yeah. us a little bit about this. What, whatever you can. Well, it's so ironic because Josie Bissett did a, uh, an arc the last few right. years, and Rob and Josie, we were all on Melrose Place together, and Rob does an arc this year, you know, with Lori Loughlin's character, Abigail. So I'm I'm like, oh, Rob's coming on the show, and it was so funny. There's a yoga studio across the street from the hotel where, you know, I stay, and I was <laughs> doing this yoga class, <laughs> and I'm kind of getting ready, and all of a sudden I see this really good-looking guy you know, across, the, you know, in the yoga studio, like, well, and I cute. go, wow, I mean, God, he's got his, and he, all of a sudden he goes, and I go, <laughs> And it's Rob Estes, and I'm like going, Rob! And so anyway, it was kind of a funny way to reunite in a, in a and yoga that's how class. I mean, how times have changed. Oh you know gosh. what I mean? Gosh. Like, just back in the day, you guys yeah. bump into each other totally, in the yoga totally. studio. That's great. So, so I know you always say that um, Aaron Krako's character, Elizabeth and Bill, always have at one really sweet scene together every season. Can we expect that again this season? Yeah, yeah, uh, it is. It's just, uh, it, it happened this season, and, uh, you know, Aaron and I have had these sort of poignant, touching yeah. scenes last year when I gave her Jack's horse, Monty Jack's oh. horse. And this year she comes and asks me a question and literally, um, you know, in rehearsal, I, I just started to get so emotional and I said, look, I, oh. I, we just need to shoot this, right? And she gets me, right? And I get her and we just had this incredible emotional scene. One a year it's kind of, but but she's such a, an actress with such range, yeah. and I, I just love working with her, so this scene is pretty special. So with what you're telling us, does that mean that you will likely have an opportunity in this new season to be looking after the baby a little bit? Ooh. Oh my gosh, there, you guys have to tell you, there is one episode where uh, Kevin Smith, who plays Lee, we do a little co-babysitting together. Okay? Oh boy. And it turns into this, um, kind of this baby battle, right? <laughs> we have this where he does it his way, I do it my way, the kid cry. I mean, it was so funny. And by the end of it, we're both clearly like wiped out and passed out when the women come home and the kids playing and up and <laughs> yeah. So, so yeah. We, we try to incorporate, or I do anyway, you know, comedy into this show. There's three and men I, and a baby. Yeah, a little bit in that <laughs> That's particular right, you're episode. Right. That's you know. it. And I just think even the Christmas movie, you know, my character's making this, his mother's dish, figgy pudding. 
and it is just a way to humanize this Bill Avery, and it happens in the kitchen. Right. And yep. Lori is such a genius at comedy, you know, with her sitcom She's experience. So good. And we have some stuff that's just really fun, you know, and that, for me, I look forward to playing those moments well, so much. As a matter of fact, we actually have that clip where really? Bill is, oh my gosh, is attempting at cooking or baking or oh, whatever it is he's it. doing, and, and Abigail is a little bit of a taste test. Oh, good, Let's I want to see this. Abigail, wait, wait. This is the one I can feel it. There. Wait. That should do. Wait for me. Hmm. Mm. Not quite there. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I wrote down all my mom's ingredients. I just don't have the right portions. Let me see. Eggs, flour, figs, milk, butter, sugar, cinnamon, nutmeg, baking powder, water, and dates. Ew. Yeah. What about the secret ingredient that goes into every homemade baked good? Secret ingredient? Love. Funny. It's not just an expression, Bill. <laughs> well, if you find any at the store, make sure you pick me up some. That's the point. You can't buy it. I love it. Yeah, I love the cast. Too. I love the show. You two together are so great. Oh, thank you. We're kind of like a married couple on this show. They push each other's buttons but have each other's back. Yeah. Right? Right, and right, don't right, kiss right. or anything. It's exactly. kind of fun. Oh, we love it. Yeah, it's, it's it. really great to play with. In, in that scene, of course, you're uh, referencing uh, Bill's mother, and I want to talk about your mom in real life, who's oh. about to celebrate her 99th Christmas. Yes, yes, that pretty is, amazing. That's huh? phenomenal. Yeah. Hi, Mom. She'll watch this tomorrow. Hi, Mom. I mean, great yeah. genes. Yes, she's incredible. She's just so resilient and tough, and uh, I just was back to see her. She actually got sick. She's never had a doctor. She's never spent a night in a hospital, okay? So she got double pneumonia. My cousin brought her to the hospital. She winds up spending a night in the hospital, and the first thing she said was, well, put the football game on. And so that's how she's kind of wired, right? <laughs> Love and, you, Mom. Uh, yeah, so she's pretty special. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Oh, there she is. This really is her 98th birthday. Oh, my birthday. goodness, I love her. <laughs> well, I have to say, you... Your love for her is just so obvious. You oh, posted okay. something just a few weeks ago, or last week even, of you and your mom when you were back visiting yeah. her. Oh, do you have that? It's on Instagram. I'd love to show everybody. Take a look at oh, this. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> 1968. 2018. <laughs> Happy holidays. Happy holidays. <laughs> oh, Goodness, Jack. Jack. Mm. Jack, that is so cute. Oh, are you getting choked up? You are. She's it's a really sweetie. It's beautiful to see. Oh, she's a beautiful woman. Well, anyway, she had never been on Instagram, so now she is. <laughs> okay, all right. That yeah, was her Instagram debut. We yeah. love that. Yeah. Um, shifting gears here a little okay. bit. I'm going to talk about something else that I okay. know that you love and I love as well, and that is the game of golf. Yeah. Oh, oh This wow. man right here is uh, practically a professional. I know you've got a really exciting tournament coming up in the new year. Yes, the Diamond Resort uh, Tournament of Champions. It's going to be 17th to 20th. In, of January, it'll be covered by Golf Channel and NBC, and it's uh, you know one of those tournaments like Lake Tahoe. It's for prize money, but yeah. every, all the proceeds and the charity goes to the uh, Children's Hospitals of Florida. Oh, how nice. So it's going to be a lot of the celebrity golfers who play, and and all of the LPGA champions of the last two years. So you know it's something I you know me Cam, I get ready for it like an Olympic athlete. I hit balls, I train like you do. Club champion of the course, yeah, you belong Altadena, to. I yeah, want to say so, that. Yeah, yeah he thank texts you. me. We saw each other the driving yeah. range, and he's like, dude, I'm playing great. They're both very good. I won. That's He's nice. awesome. He that's is. Nice. But anyway, so that's, all right. all that's what I'm looking for. When yeah. is, what are those dates again? 17 to 20th of January. Oh, we're going to have to look for a fill-in for you? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to put in for <laughs> some vacation they want days. You. They no, want you right there. There. Well, Get off. that's I, very I'm kind. I'll caddy for you, Jack. I'll caddy for you. We can come shoot from We'll, we'll do it live. We'll do it live from there. Jack, I love you, man. Thanks, it's always great to see you. Thank you. Everything. Love your mom, too. Don't miss the Christmas Day premiere of When Calls the Heart, the greatest Christmas blessing, of course, 8, 7 Central, right here on Hallmark Channel. And now is when we'd like to remind you as well that you can access Hallmark Channel's official podcast on Apple and Google Podcasts, offering exclusive previews, behind-the-scenes stories, and surprise guests. Like we mentioned earlier, Debbie and I had the uh, the honor of hosting the very first episode with so this much guy fun right here, and also Aaron Craco as well. And Wes Brown, I'm telling you, yeah. if you haven't listened to it, you should.